All right, here are five things you know as you get ready to start your day. An inmate has died at the Mountain View Correctional Facility. Officials say 86-year-old Robert Craig died yesterday morning. They have not said how he died, but the Attorney General's Office and the Medical Examiner's Office have been notified. That is standard procedure. The uh, When an inmate dies, Craig is at least the 21st inmate to die in a jail or prison in Maine this year. You might remember Jojo Morales. He's a little boy from Florida who was spotted in Maine after he was reported missing by his mother over the summer. Jojo's grandmother, Lilia Morales, will be in a South Florida courtroom today facing two charges in connection with her grandson's kidnapping. A judge out in Miami denied Lilia Morales' request to be released on bond last week, so she will be back in court this morning. Mental health is a big concern for young teenagers in Maine. A survey just released by the state shows nearly 30% of middle schoolers in Maine say they've had feelings of sadness or hopelessness that has lasted more than two weeks. This is just in the last year. The number actually jumps to more than a third of students when you go to Piscataquis or Somerset counties. Every commute involves the Casco Bay Bridge. You are less likely to get stuck behind a big truck coming up because that's because the main DOT is banning all vehicles that weigh more than 25 tons from using the bridge while DOT crews do some maintenance work to that bridge. This is expected to last about one week. NFL from yesterday, big game Niners and Dolphins. San Francisco able to knock off Miami 33-17 behind their new star quarterback Brock Purdy. Google it. He was Mr. Irrelevant from the 2022 draft, the very last player that was chosen. He's pretty relevant right now. He's their starting quarterback. Jimmy Garoppolo out for the season with a broken foot. Miami and San Francisco, both eight and four on the season. Miami lost, good thing for the Patriots, oh, by the way. That is. So they play Patriots, by the way, a week from tonight. They're Monday Night Football in Arizona next week. Yep, so. they are. They're heading out west. Uh, today, mostly sunny to start the week. We'll be in the mid 40s. We have one storm system in the cards for the week. It's Tuesday night and Wednesday. Also looks mild, so we'll see rain showers. End of the week does chill off into the weekend. And right now, there's a small chance for something over the weekend, but it's not. It's not a very, very large one. It's not going to be white yet. Still, not still, yet. Still got some wet. Still waiting for the pattern to adjust and shift a little bit. Maybe that's next week, but. This week looks okay. We still have time. Yeah, we, we do. We got 20 days. I'm not going to complain about it. We do. Not yet. <laughs> have a good day, everybody.